Hello, welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch. In this video, we're going to go ahead and check out a new type of host by Experiments. Uh, from what I've seen, the pictures, it looks pretty cool. So I thought we'd give it a go and see how well it works. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. We'll go into settings. I will show you that I don't have the goal 10 options and I don't have debug settings. So we'll go up and just make sure our network is connected. And if it's checked, we're good to go. So we'll go ahead and back out of there. I've already went ahead and added it to my favorites. So we'll go ahead and just close the first window and we'll make sure everything is cleared there as well as in our browser history. And then finally we'll go into our settings and delete our cookies and clear our website data. After that we'll go ahead and go into our bookmarks and I have it right here, xhost 9.00. So we'll go ahead and select it. Give it a few moments here. It looks like it's uh, running the, the exploit plus goal 10. So Okay, awaiting kernel exploit. Okay, seems to lock up there, so we should get a message to insert our USB any moment now. Okay, insert USB, so we'll go ahead and plug it in. And we'll give it a few moments here to pop up with unsupported file system. Okay, there we go. We'll go ahead and hit OK. Okay, goal 10 2.0 loaded. Uh, there's not enough memory. That happens usually with every jailbreak. Uh, so we'll just go ahead and hit OK on it. Okay, from here I believe we can go into the payload section. And we're using our D-pad at the time. As you can see, there's no uh, mouse cursor or no little hand. So we'll go ahead and press right on our D-pad and enter payloads. Hit X. And it loads us into here. So up the top, we can go into our fan controls. And using our D-pad, we can press over or left or right, depending on which direction we want to go. We can also hit down. So in our main, we got our FTP, app to USB, and dump game. Utilities, Orbis's Toolbox, uh, DB Backup, DB Restore, Riff Renamer, and History Blocker. Oh, it keeps on going. To Dex, Exit ID, U. Okay, Switches, Enable Updates. You can see basically what's there. Debug. Linux is all there. And then the About tab. Okay, so let's go ahead. I'm not sure if it uses the bin loader or not. Um, let's go ahead and just test that out. We'll hit the PlayStation button, over to our settings, go into our goal 10, and we'll go ahead and enable bin loader. So we'll go ahead and hit our PlayStation button again, and go back to our browser. Okay, and we'll go ahead and go into our payload section. And we'll go down to Utilities. We'll try loading Orbis's Toolbox. Okay, it seems to be taking a few moments. So it doesn't use the bin loader. Um, oh, actually it does. Payload received. Orbis's Toolbox loaded. Okay. So let's go ahead and uh, go back out of here. Our Orbis's Toolbox loads, but no issues. Uh, we'll go into settings. We do have our Orbis's toolbox here as well. Let's go ahead and test rest mode. So we'll go over to power. We'll go ahead and enter rest mode. Now it does take a few moments to boot down. Um, but while it's doing, I'll let you know what the lights are doing. We currently just have a pulse in blue, or white I should say. Okay, still pulsing. Seems to be going good so far. No issues. Uh, we do have the amber now pulsing. Okay. A few more moments and it should go solid. Okay. Still pulsing though.
Okay, and it's gone solid amber, so we'll go ahead and hit the PlayStation button on our controller. I do hear the beep. It does go blue, the light. Okay, now let's pull some blue. Okay, any moment it should come up on our screen. We do have a... still. It's still pulsing, but... Uh, should go solid any moment. Okay, so our light is solid now. We'll go ahead and hit the PlayStation button on our controller. And I heard the beep, so it should turn on any moment now. I did try it a few times with Orbis's toolbox loaded, and when loading it, it always crashed. Um, so as long as we don't have Orbis's toolbox loaded, everything should work in rest mode. So we'll go ahead and log in here. And as you can see, Orbis's toolbox is no longer loaded because I wasn't able to actually get it to come out of rest mode successfully uh, with it loaded. But as you can see, we do have our goal 10 options and we do have our debug settings. But yeah, guys, that's basically it for the video. I did enjoy that host. I do like the, uh, the new style where you just use your D-pad to scroll around. But yeah, if you did like the video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It really helps out the channel. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.